Today we are covering Salesforce Certified Business Analyst. To find the complete list of questions and answers, please go to the playlist link provided in the description. If you like this content, do like, share and subscribe to this channel. Question is, the business analyst BA at a universal containers has been capturing the requirements for a major sales cloud release. An admin has been deploying the resulting system changes. The quality assurance QA team has run into challenges when testing the changes. The BA is unaware of deployment and testing challenges. What should the BA do to resolve these challenges with the release team? Option A. Involve the stakeholders in the business requirements gathering sessions. Option B. Provide detailed test cases to validate the functional requirements. Option C. Associate each set of metadata changes to the corresponding user story. Correct answer is option B. Next question is Universal Containers is setting up a Salesforce email integration for the sales team. Through discovery conversations, the business analyst BA learns the operations team also needs email integration in the near future. What should the BA do next? Option A. Include the operations team during discovery. Option B. Proceed with the sales team's project as planned. Option C. Start project work for the operations team. Correct answer is option A. Next question is the business analyst BA at Universal Containers UC wants to understand why UC failed to meet a deployment date for its product go live while following the agile process. According to the BA's research, the developers lagged a sense of the work in progress and the intended goal of that work, and the QA team was unable to clearly test the functionality based on a given persona. Which step should the BA take next? Option A. Create a SWOT strength weakness opportunity threat analysis to understand why development and testing took more time. Option B. Move the deployment date out so the teams have more time to work. Option C. Review the user stories to ensure they are small, testable and valuable. Correct answer is option C. Next question is a business analyst BA at Universal Containers UC has been asked to evaluate a business process at a high level and in detail while also keeping regulatory considerations in mind. Management wants to use the output from the BA's evaluation to inform decisions about UC's future implementation of Sales Cloud and Service Cloud. What should the BA use for their evaluation? Option A. Universal Process Notation UPN. Option B. Entity Relationship Diagram ERD. Option C. Cross Functional Flowchart. Correct answer is Option A. Next question is A sales manager expresses frustration that the sales team is failing to enter calls in Salesforce. The manager is hoping to resolve the issue quickly and has limited time and budget to completely revamp existing tools and processes. The sales manager re reaches out to the business analyst BA for recommendations. What should the BA do next? Option A. Research third-party apps on the app exchange. Option B. Export a weekly report of user activity. Option C. Engage a developer to scope a custom solution. Correct answer is option A. Next question is Cloud Kicks has an existing implementation of Salesforce. A business analyst BA 
wants to understand details about the Salesforce environment. Custom apps, active Salesforce sites, active flows, custom tabs, visual force pages. Which path should the BA take to find this information? Option A. Conduct stakeholder interviews. Option B. Read business process documentation. Option C. Review configuration settings. Correct answer is option C. Next question is the business analyst at Universal Containers is helping the team transition from workflow rules to flows. The work has been built and it is time to kick off user acceptance testing UAT. What is the goal of UAT? Option A. To ensure that to ensure what was originally requested is being delivered. Option B. To identify acceptance criteria with pass-fail indicators. Option C. To summarize the overall ask and determine what is in scope. Correct answer is option A. 